today's video, I'm going to teach you how to adjust the G3 target telemark binding for various boot sizes. For basic adjustment of the length of this binding, we're going to be just simply twisting the spring cartridges. Spin them to the right to tighten the binding, spin them to the left to loosen the binding, and make sure to do even turns on both sides so that the binding is pulling on both springs evenly. So in this case, when the toe of the boot is all the way forward, this cable is currently too long. So we're going to shorten the length of the cable by twisting both spring cartridges to the right. And when sizing this up, I want to spin these to the right until the heel throw on the boot sits pretty tight to the back of the boot so that when you flip that up, it has a nice snap. Depending on your boot size or cable length, you might not be able to adjust the binding properly to your boot size by simply spinning the spring cartridges. We're going to grab some tools and I'm going to show you more advanced adjustment for the cable length. For more advanced adjustment, you're going to need a small Phillips head screwdriver, a flathead screwdriver, and a posi drive screwdriver. First thing we're going to need to do is remove the anti-ice plate with the small Phillips head screwdriver. If you remove the screw in the front of the anti-ice plate, then you're going to need to pry the anti-ice plate off of the binding. Now that the anti-ice plate is off of the binding, we're going to need to take the toe piece off of the base plate. When you remove those four screws, you take the toe plate off of the base plate and you reveal the cable routing. In this case, the cable is currently configured in the shorter variation where the cable is looped around. If we needed to lengthen this cable, we can take this cable out and put it straight across the cable routing there. Place the cable in the straight across position on the cable routing. Then we're gonna need to refasten the binding by getting the toe plate lined up with the four holes on the base plate. And then we're gonna grab our tools and reinstall these screws. I like to go in a diamond pattern. Then we're gonna reinstall the ice plate. There's a little tab right here that Latches, latches into that notch and then finally the small screw in the front of the anti-ice plate. If you're going to be using the loop configuration to effectively make the cable shorter, you're going to want to get the cable centered so that the center of the cable lines up with the middle of the toe piece and then as you press this piece, the cable into the groove, if you get it like that and then keep your finger or thumb on there and as you keep pressure on the cable, if you slide the toe piece forward, it's gonna automatically feed the cable through the routing on the side. While keeping pressure on the toe piece to hold the cable in place, then we'll grab our hardware and reinstall the toe piece. Finally, reinstall the ice plate, pushing in from the back, setting the screw, Tightening it down. Action. And that's how you adjust the G3 target cable to your boot size. 